Welcome to another video from Dr. Locke. How clean is my bench? Oh, spectacular. It's not really the truth. I'll tell you what's going on on my bench, the site that you can't see. And I <clears throat> wanted to give a shout out to a few people out there who actually enjoy picking locks, even if they're frustrating. One person said, I'm not going to be spending money on new locks for a while to learn how to pick. And that was, uh, who was that? Monkey Fingers. So I thought to myself, I'm going to change this video up, I'm going to spark it up, I'm going to show you what's on my bench to start with, and then I'm going to show you what I'm just going to give away. Because I've got too many locks, they're coming out of every orifice, too many locks. So I'm just going to give away a bunch of locks designed for the real world, rusty, you name it, can have dirt in it, you name it, and let's see who wants to pick it. So I'm going to give away five sets of locks. We've got these bags here, see these ones? This means you've got to be in Australia and you've got to be a subscriber. All you've got to do is say, look, I'm a subscriber and also I want something from me. I want your lucky number because in Australia we've got a $60 million lotto draw and I can't pick enough winning numbers. So I'm a subscriber. This is my lucky number. I'll email you back. Um, there's no terms and conditions. I'm just going to pick five people around random. And if you can display showing picking these locks that I give you, awesome. You know, the lock picking community and lock sport, that's awesome. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to give away a, a truckload of locks because I've got too many. And somebody's going to enjoy picking them. And it's going to be real world locks with grease and crap and all sorts that have just pulled off a job in the last so many years. Might be a 10 year old lock. Who knows? Might be a five-year-old lock, might be a two-year-old lock. Who knows? Anyway, on my bench, uh, an emergency key for a Nissan. Sorry, Mazda is just sitting there. Okay, I have this box here. This is a TV set-top box Android running uh, through a HDMI sort of thing. I'm going to try and install Instacode on this. <laughs> I'm going to try and install Instacode on a TV box with a 4K resolution and all the rest. Okay. That's going to be a bit of a challenge, a bit of computer work. I'm going to push that aside now because I'm going to show you what else is happening on my bench. On my bench here, I've cut myself some pre-cut keys. I'm going to be using them in the next few weeks. It's awesome to have pre-cut keys. Here's a bunch of 30. I'm just going to pull them out whenever, whenever need be. I've got some mailboxes to do. Here's some mailboxes. So what I've actually got to do to install these mailbox locks, it gets harder than just installing it. I've got to give the agent the keys first now our locks were lucky they come with three keys so i give the agent two keys then i install it and then i give them the third key so that's a, a little bit of a tip that helps me out and that's what's sitting on my bench at the moment on top of that oh i've got the worst headache because i've just cut a truckload of um locks uh, sorry a truckload of keys for a building oh sorry it's eight buildings and I've had to cut them numerous amounts of keys. So the key machine, the poker, Silka poker has been working non-stop. And I've got all the keys to give to them on Monday. So there goes a good three to four hours of my day just cutting keys. Alright, so what am I going to give you? Alright, let me grab a box. I can only do one box at a time. Because oh, this thing is... Let me guess. Oh, come on. This is 50 kilo. Ah. Oh. That's 50 kilo. Easy. Oh, all right. Let's go through this. Now I'm going to pick out 20. 20 cylinders per batch. That's 100 cylinders or maybe 15, you know, roughly. These are real world cylinders right here. And I've just got absolutely too many. So if you're one of those lock sport people and you love picking locks just for the fun of it, then I'm going to give you a couple of challenges right here, right now, in this box. Now, you can't see this box. I've got three or four of these bad boys. They're cylinders from everywhere. Now, first cab off the rank. We have a leggy, which looks like a restricted lane profile. Number one. We have number two, an interlock cylinder C4 profile. Number two. You can reuse all these cylinders too. Now this one's interesting because it's got the cam up the middle. So that's uh, for one of these, could be a glass uh, sliding door or so. That's a, that's an easy one. That can go in there. Oh, here we go. Another lane restricted. So it's basically lane profile, but in reverse. I'm going to focus in because it's not fair if I don't focus. Okay. 
And I'm going to be throwing in a car lock. Looks like a Mazda. So, anyone wants to pick locks for fun? Here we go. I've got some for you. Uh, what's this here? Lockwood. Older style Lockwood because it's stamped in. Still a Lockwood. Good cylinder. Another cylinder. Okay. Throwing a, sta a standard C4 570 cylinder. Uh, another lane. We can't give you too many lane. But to give you something um, fun. Like a Yale with spool pins. You'll enjoy that one. Okay, so that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We need at least ten. An old Lockwood C4R. Nine. An FCO. An old FCO off the job. Why is this not in focus? Here. Come on camera, come on camera. There we go. Best I can do. An FCO. Okay, so that's an example of what I'm going to be throwing. Oh, here's a goodie. I can't. Yeah, there's another goodie. Look at that restricted bad boy. So that's just a sample of what I'm going to do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull out five of these bags like this. And all I want you to do is basically just say, I subscribed. And actually, you'll need to actually hit the button and subscribe. And um, tell me a lucky number because I want to win the lotto draw. And I'm running out of lot lucky lotto numbers. All right. So I want some lotto numbers. If you are a fellow locksmith and you've got a profile, let me know your profile because I've got bags like this of restrictor plugs. And I can probably throw a few of them in too if you've got a, a restrictor plug like this. What's this one here? It's got a little A on the side. I think, not even sure who that is. But they're all, they're all good. You know, so um, I'll send you a whole heap of locks. Pick them, pick them on camera, see how you go, and uh, post a video, leave a response in the descriptions down below. I'd love to see you picking all of these open because these are real world locks. Even something like this this is a Widco, it's only um, LW5, sorry, LW4 or C4, but it's got the you know, it's slightly die cast, and they're, they're, sometimes they can be a real challenge. Uh, we've got everything here, absolutely everything. Even a deadbolt gazer, there's one. That can be a bit of fun. And um, so, just getting back to the comment, somebody said, oh, I won't have to spend money on locks for a little while. Well, no, you won't. If you enjoy picking locks for fun, leave a comment down in the description, tell me you're a subscriber, leave your lucky number, and I'll email you back. Once, once we email, we'll email direct from our private emails, and then just tell me where to send it, and I'll send it. I'll probably do five, I'll probably do ten, I don't know. I'm going to clear some of this stuff out because I am swimming in this sort of stuff and half of it goes in recycling, half of it doesn't. Like that right there, I could make keys to it. I just don't have the time. Trilock cylinder. Okay, doesn't have the cams. Still fun to pick. These little double-sided wafers. Still fun, to, still fun to pick. A couple of PD cylinders. Yeah, yeah. Uh, this one here. I could even reuse that on a job. It's not bad. So I've got plenty of cylinders. Plenty of cylinders to give away. This is a cylinder giveaway. Okay. I'll give you 10. I'll give you 20. If you've got a restrictor profile, maybe I can throw in a few of them. Let's see what I can clear out. And I'll give it to you for free. Uh, these ones here, I'll even pay the postage too. Because you guys love picking uh, locks. And it's something I can do for the subscribers. Just to uh, help the lock picking community. The pick pick pickers who pick more than they should be picking or pick more than they want to pick who knows when you like to pick you like to pick so i'm going to give all the, uh well i'm going to try and give one of these boxes away because i've got three or four of them and i'm telling you now no word of a lie just lifting this is 40 kegs 40 to 50 kegs seriously you've got even ones like this yale you know you might come up against a yale like this can't pick it might have to drill it I've got the cylinder for you. Here's one. Here's one. Anyone want to try challenging picking that bad boy? Copy Abloy. Still the same structure, but you won't pick him. I've had that one for 28 years at least. Anyway, leave your comments down below. There's another Trilock cylinder. Leave your comments down below. Um, all you got to do to to win right all you got to do is just say i'm a subscriber and actually be a subscriber because i will check give me your lucky lotto number so i can win lotto and if i do win lotto and then one of your numbers was lucky i might send you a smart pro or something something cool and um 
yeah once i email you tell me where to send it i don't care where i send it i'll pay for the postage here's a bylock anyone want to try picking a bylock good luck australian made product um yeah all sorts here we'd go just goes and goes and goes screen screen double-sided wafer euro euro most of these are pickable so i will try and find um some reasonable ones that'll give you some sort of challenge here we go there's a challenge laser engraved spool pins to a one cylinder there's a challenge just sitting there waiting for people like you to say i'll give that a go another bowl off. i'll give that a go me oh here, here's one here's one i started earlier it's got to be a shim up the bum of it see See, this one has uh, the spool pins in it, and it's nasty. That's why it's left like that, left in that condition. Anyway, if you want a challenge, I have too many cylinders sitting here, and to be quite honest, they're just taking up room. Taking up room. Here's one on a restricted profile. Who's, whose profile is this? Oh, I don't know. 26B Lockwood Restricted Profile. Probably got spool pins. Comes with a key. 26B on the front. Nightmare of a keyway. That's one that can go to God or go to a good lock picker. Okay, leave your comments down below. I hope you indulge and want to take some of this off my hands. I will give you challenges, yeah, challenges, real world challenges. They got dirt, they got rust, they got crap, they're missing face plates, they're missing keys, they're missing tail pieces, they've even got keys, they've got turn snibs, they've got no housing, they're missing paint. And they're missing screws everything you could ever want from a cylinder i'm just going to give to whoever wants to pick it anyway leave a comment down below thanks for watching